I'm Stacy, and I'm a real housewife. I have an ordinary house and ordinary kids. I have ordinary hobbies. I have an ordinary routine. However, one day I learned what makes me extraordinary. Upon entering the pantry while preparing lunch for my children, I reached for the bread and I saw it. Or should I say him? It was a mouse. But to my own astonishment, I didn't scream, nor did the mouse run. I looked at him and he looked at me and I looked at him looking at me and... And that's when I knew. I was no ordinary housewife. I am a mouse hunter. I began buying traps and it seemed that I instinctively knew that the mice would be attracted to peanut butter as opposed to the common belief that mice have a preference for cheddar cheese. Soon I was sometimes trapping up to eight mice in a 24 hour period, but that wasn't enough. I found myself awake at night configuring patterns in which to set the mouse traps to confuse even the brightest mouse in order to raise my mortality rate. This worked for a while. As soon as I killed the dumber mice off, the intelligence level of their survivors began to increase. In fact, the highly intelligent mice learned to lick the bait pedal clean of peanut butter without ever setting it off. I tried poison. These rats of Nim didn't even touch the stuff. In fact, they even trapped me once. I have a master's degree for heaven's sakes and was outsmarted by a field mouse, a superior intelligence created by a screwed up survival of the fittest Darwinistic Big Bang watch the rodents evolve in a bubble-like environment thing, but a stupid mouse nonetheless. This just fueled my vengeance. In my fury, I patched the openings on the holes in the house inside and out, poured the remaining poison down into the crawl space as their only source of food. Ralph Waldo Emerson once said, build a better mousetrap and the world will be the path to your door. Well, bring it on. R-O-U-S's, beware.